I don't know if Sick Red Tail will take this piece or not. But he took a piece last week, which I missed to film for you as a proof. He took a large piece uh, four days ago. That was the first piece that he took probably after many, many months of uh, being sick and receiving two vitamin B1 shots. But I had visitors over and I didn't have time to film it. And he's been much more active since then. Hybrid just took a huge piece, so he's all set. Somebody else took a large piece last time too. I, I just left two big pieces and Red Tail definitely had a big bump in its tummy. I don't know who took the other piece, probably one of the Perun sharks I'm guessing. And I really want to see Red Tail eat again and have it on tape so that it's documented and proven. But it's not always as easy as you would like. It was probably hard for him to digest that large piece after not having been eaten for half a year. Maybe a little less, maybe four or five months he hasn't eaten. Come on, you're smelling it, right? I know you're smelling it. No? He knows it's there. You can see by his shaking barbells. Come on, sweetie, good job. Good job. Another tremendous appetite. Tremendous appetite used to be that he would come up to the surf surface or right exactly where I was feeding and grab food. But nevertheless, I'm, I'm glad to see a second feeding in a row. He's taking large pieces of the large mullet, pre soaked in vitamin B1 and Vitacam. So again, that likely proves that my hypothesis of the vitamin B1 deficiency was correct. Whether it was the only cause of its fast, I don't know. But I would assume this was the primary cause. As a reminder, I gave him two vitamin B1 injections by syringe. One of them was done about two and a half months ago and the second was given to him one and a month one and a half months ago He's still working on it, you can see it from the gills flaring out. Even though the piece I gave him wasn't the biggest at all. Should have been a easily swallow swallowable. I think he's done, yep. He got it down. Yeah, I can see a little bump in the tummy.
Okay, so we'll pen it down as another success in treating the fish after I, I let them develop vitamin B1 deficiency. Live and learn. And still die a fool, as we say in our language. Throwed another piece for the Peruns, but he came over and grabbed it too. I don't think he's gonna take it. He's gonna spit it out probably. Given how long he took to swallow the first piece. But he took the tail third of a large mullet in its mouth again. Please don't spit it out in the drain. Trying to swallow it in earnest. In earnest. Working on it, still trying. Even if he doesn't swallow it, this attempt makes me happy, even happier. Shows that it's got even better appetite than I thought. He's trying. By the way, he started by eating pellets before the last feeding when he took his first mullet. He was partaking some of the pellets, I noticed it, the previous couple of feedings. Yeah, he got it down. He swallowed it. Wow. Double happy. Good job.
Now I believe he's coming back even more. He used to be a gluten. And he just showed it to me, a glimpse of what he used to be just now. By taking on the second piece, which I thought he, would, he was not going to have. Now the bulge in the tummy is much bigger. Just as my satisfaction and happiness.